Here's Post Parade for the 8th. Hogan 0 is 1 with Rick Zero on for Tony Arts and Mardon Stables. Gino Toscani, owner and driver of 2. Cam, terrific. Winning goalie, 3 with Tony Kerwood for Jim Smith. Burloak Stable. Cal Leibowitz, Banjo Farms, Tom Mottram, owners of 4. Kenny Hanover, Randy Waples driving. Strong Clan 5 has Doug Brown for Algon Strong and Peter MacArthur. Wellwood Stables owning, Paul McDonnell, Drive 6, Village Connection. Riyadh is number 7, John Campbell for Peter Heffering. Free for all pace, the purse is $35,000. The eighth race free for allers are in the back stretch and picking up speed. And they're off and pacing, uh, leaving hardest of all out of there. Tight to the inside is Kim, terrific. And on the outside, they're going out fast as they can as well. There's Strong Clan, leaving out with Village Connection and Riyadh. Riyadh is heading to the front, into the first turn. Village Connection carrying him as far as he can. On down to the quarter and Strong Clan. Two more lengths back in third, then Cam Terrific is fourth. Hogan's Heroes winning goalie in the early trailer is Kenny Hanover. Riyadh establishes the lead in 26-1. and one. Riyadh up front, coming in front of the grandstand, close to 50 lengths front to back. Village Connection following up in second. It's about six more lengths to Strong Clan there in third. Cam Terrific is fourth. Hogan's Heroes fifth. Then Kenny Hanover and winning goalie seventh at the inside. Riyadh on top by two on Village Connection rounding the clubhouse turn. Village Connection tracking along. Three more lengths to Strong Clan in third. Cam Terrific came out from fourth and Riyadh is up at the half in 54 and two. 28 and one second quarter. Riyadh just like she He's a great lady is drawing away for Campbell in the backstretch. Riyadh has opened a huge lead of close to 10 lengths on the way to three quarters. Strong Clan now comes on to be in second. Village Connection is back in third. Cam Terrific under heavy urging is fourth at the outside. Winning goalie fifth. Then Hogan's Heroes and Kenny Hanover and Riyadh in 122. He may be going for it. The track record is 151 set all those years ago by Matt Scooter and Riyadh brings it to the top of the stretch. Strong Clan is now clearly second. Cam Terrific laboring on the outside. Hogan's Heroes to his outside is fourth through the stretch. And Riyadh with Strong Clan six lengths in arrears. Cam Terrific, Hogan's Heroes, and Kenny Hanover up in the middle. Here is the finish for Riyadh. Winner by five. A new track record of 150 and three. Riyadh over Strong Clan and Cam Terrific. Another track record. Mile in the 34 year history of Mohawk Raceway. The special winner's photograph is being taken over by the infield teletimer by track photographer Brian Smiley. And it's the multiple world champion Riyadh that will go back and pose. 150 and 3. It's the fastest race mile in the 34 year history of Mohawk Raceway. Riyadh, the six-year-old son of Jay Lobel, also set the Woodbine and Canadian records earlier this summer in 148-4. And, and returns home tonight to set the Mohawk and Canadian records on a 5 8 mile track in 150-3. Owned by Peter Heffering of Port Perry, trained by Sean Robinson from the Bill Robinson Stable, and driven to the record mile by John Campbell. And for those of you off track, you may be interested to know that uh, since the Milton Stakes was three races ago, the west wind and breeze has kicked up again, making the effort by Riyadh even more remarkable. 150 and 3, longest standing Mohawk Raceway track record set by Matt Scooter in the fall of 1989. We're going to get a replay of Junior Free For All, Free For All. We talked all about this race. We talked all about this horse, Riyadh. John Campbell joined us. Uh, John, let's talk about how you left because this is all it. Well, he, he gets out of the gate extremely well. Uh, he's uh, just a very unique horse that he's left his whole career and he's still very manageable. You can do whatever you want with him, but uh, he's, he's very quick out of the gate. 
We're going to talk about She's a Great Lady as well, but uh, right here, a time of 26 and 1. Uh, your splits are unbelievable, a new track record, John. Uh, as you said, it's very easy with this horse. Yeah, there's no trick to drive him. I think if you tied the lines on the seat and put him on the gate, he could do <laughs> most of that on his Rocky own. Rocky could do this, too? I, I think he could. He's, could he's just course. that professional. John, were you, were you conscious of the fact that Village Connection early in the race was right on your tail here? Yeah, but I, at the half when he uh, couldn't keep up to me, right. I, I, I was fully aware of that. And then uh, about the only time this horse can get beat is the horse pops out of the two-hole or something and beats him. And when they weren't keeping up, it, <laughs> this two-hole's a long way behind. Well, it's, it's hard to keep up to it. <laughs> We, uh, John, is there any uh, thought about the track record tonight? Not really. They just said he was up to a good mile, and uh, you know he felt good at the half, so I let him roll along. And uh, you know he did everything else. Uh, uh, a little lackadaisical finishing, but every time you get his attention, he just uh, picks it up again. I was going to ask you about that, John. Like, 21 and 2 to the three quarters, but like you had this race, like it was in the bag, as to say. Uh, could he have gone faster if he'd have been pushed by somebody? I think I mean, if he'd have heard horses around him, he'd have gone right, faster. Because okay, when he right. heard them catch up to him down in the turn there, he took a hold a bit again. Uh, here he's just, uh, he's not paying attention as much as, yeah. yeah. And you just have to keep his attention a little bit, and he does the rest. Did the, this trip at all remind you she's a great lady back in the uh, fifth? Well, so it's somewhat similar, yeah. They're, they're both... <laughs> Nobody very, around? <laughs> yeah, both tremendously gated horses, and I think that's the key to both their success. They they don't waste any motion. They're they're very easy horses to drive. Well, John Campbell, congratulations. Uh, Sean Robinson, Robinson Stables, winning combination for Riyadh. Also, John, congratulations. Track and stakes record with She's a Great Lady. You had a great week at Lexington as well, or a great couple of weeks. Congratulations. Uh, continued success. Every time we see you, continued success. Thanks a lot, Glenn. I hope, All right. hope to see you on the weekend. Oh, you bet. Okay. Thank you very much, John. Campbell again, Riyadh, winner of race number eight, junior free-for-all, a new track record, 150 and three.